I think surgery will always be a critical part of the upfront management of the initial diagnosed uh, patient with melanoma. I think surgery is becoming de-emphasized a bit in the patient with a, uh, in fact, de-emphasized entirely in the, in the patient with a positive sentinel node. In the patients with clinically positive nodes, I think this role of surgery is going to evolve. If you ask me to predict the future, I think it will evolve as we integrate neoadjuvant strategies, uh, hopefully uh, to the benefit of the patient, minimizing the, the extent of surgery and the attendant morbidity. The, the, I think the most interesting uh, area of evol evolving area of surgery in melanoma is clearly in patients with advanced or metastatic disease. Uh, and, and we're having more and more scenarios, more and more opportunities for surgery to intervene in the management of these patients. In fact, uh, there were two New England Journal articles published recently in which they looked at uh, what happened after patients recurred on clinical trials, one an adjuvant trial and one a, th one a trial of treatment for advanced disease. And in both series, about 20% of the patients who relapsed on those trials, surgery was uh, uh, required and operations a part of their management. That, I think, is a growing area of surgery in melanoma.